Good morning, National Dayers! It's Mrs. Erickson. Today is Friday, October 20th. It is the 293rd day of the year. There are 72 days left. Happy National Chicken and Waffles Day! Savory and sweet collide for a soulful celebration of flavor on October 20th as we celebrate National Chicken and Waffles Day. Imagine a world where ingredients of every spice and spirit find their way into the honeycombs of thick and crispy waffles. Well, that day has arrived. From LA to NYC, this quintessential meal of the rural South made a slow migration to the urban communities to the North and West. But as odd as it seems, chicken and waffles have been around for more than 150 years. And while no one knows who first put chicken and waffles on the same plate together, we do know the meal was a staple of both African American cooks and the Pennsylvania Dutch. Part breakfast, part supper, everyone can enjoy chicken and waffles any time of the day. Enjoy your favorite version of chicken and waffles. The limitless combinations entice people to create their own versions. You can too. Add some gravy or go traditional. Turn yours into a sandwich or make it a mini. Herb it up or go sweeter. No matter how you celebrate, make sure you invite someone to join. Today is also National Day on Writing. National Youth Confidence Day, Talent Transformation Day, and World Statistics Day. All right, National Dayers, it's time for mini chicken and waffles. Gather the following ingredients. You'll need frozen popcorn chicken, frozen mini waffles, and then honey, toothpicks, and a toaster. All right. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna cook the chicken in the microwave or your oven, just following the directions on the package. And you're gonna take those mini waffles and you're gonna throw those babies in the toaster until they're nice and crispy. You can even put a little burn on them like I did because I like the flavor of that. Next, you're going to assemble by placing a piece of chicken on top of the little waffle and you're going to secure it by inserting a toothpick through both of them. Drizzle them both with as much honey as you would like. You could also use syrup. And then you can sprinkle with cinnamon or seasoned salt for added flavor, depending on what kind of taste you're trying to go with. And you've got some mini chicken and waffles. A great snack, a great meal. They're just great. All right, National Dayers. I mean, chicken and waffles? You're talking savory, you're talking sweet, and these guys are one bite portable deliciousness. This is a great day. Keep smiling, have a fabulous Friday, an amazing weekend, and I will see you right back here on Monday. Bye. Oh, it's time. Yes. Oh, that's a big bite. It's time for super spectacular shout outs. Our shout outs today start us off with Ms. Burson and everyone in the academic assist class at Perrysburg High School in Perrysburg, Ohio. Next up is Mrs. Bender and everyone in the middle school program at Perkyoman Valley Middle School in East Collegeville, Pennsylvania. And our third shout out today goes out to Mrs. Proctor and everyone in her fifth grade class at Springfield Public Day Elementary School in Springfield, Massachusetts. Thank you so much for watching and thank you for your support. I hope you loved your shout out. Teachers, if you'd like to get your class a shout out, just complete the Google form. The link can be found below this video in the description. And here it is, our updated super spectacular shout out map.